ever pondered over how the laptop you're using or the coffee you're sipping made its journey to you? In a world intricately connected by trade, the everyday items that we use often have a fascinating global journey to narrate. This journey of goods, from the producer to you, the consumer, is made possible through the intricate and vast network of global trade. Global trade, a concept that's as old as human civilizations, is the lifeblood of our modern economies. It's the reason why you can enjoy Colombian coffee in Manchester or relish Belgian chocolates in Sydney. It's the reason why the laptop you are using, which was assembled in China, using parts from various countries, has reached your desk. The unsung heroes facilitating this global exchange of goods are seaports. Acting as the gateways to global trade, they play a pivotal role in our daily lives, often unnoticed. These bustling hubs of activity are where the world's goods come in and go out, connecting producers and consumers, countries and continents. From solar panels and electric goods to nutrition supplements, laptops, leather, rubber and sports goods, seaports handle an astonishing variety of products. To give you a sense of the scale, around 90% of the world's trade is transported by sea. That's an incredible nine out of every 10 products you use. Seaports are not just about shipping containers and cranes. They are vibrant ecosystems where technology, infrastructure and human endeavor come together to keep the wheels of global trade turning. They are places of constant activity where goods from around the world are unloaded, sorted and then dispatched to various destinations. Each item that you use daily has its unique journey. The leather for your shoes might have started its journey in Argentina, the rubber for your car tires might have come from Thailand, and the laptop you are using might have been assembled in China. All these products have one thing in common. They have passed through one or more seaports before reaching you. Yes, the items you use daily have probably seen more of the world than you have thanks to the bustling activity of our seaports. So how massive is the scale of import and export through seaports really? Well, let's dive in and see. Picture this. Every year, billions upon billions of goods are transported across the globe via seaports. These range from everyday items like food and clothing to high-tech equipment and machinery. The scale is truly mind-boggling. Let's take solar panels, for example. With the global push towards renewable energy, the demand for solar panels is skyrocketing. Countries all over the world are importing them by the shipload, literally. In fact, the annual global import of solar panels alone is enough to cover the entire city of London, twice over. And that's just one type of commodity. Electric goods such as laptops, smartphones and home appliances also make up a significant chunk of seaport trade. To give you a sense of the scale, if you lined up all the laptops imported in a year, they would stretch from London all the way to Sydney and then some. But it's not just tech goods. Food and nutrition products, leather, rubber, sports goods and many more items also ride the waves to reach consumers worldwide. For instance, the leather imported annually could outfit every person in the United Kingdom with a brand new pair of leather shoes every single year. And let's not forget about rubber. From car tires to erasers, rubber is an essential part of our lives. The quantity of rubber traded through seaports annually is enough to manufacture over a billion car tires. That's more than enough for every car on the planet. So just imagine the size and scale of the operations that make all of this possible. The logistics, the manpower, the technology. It's a veritable symphony of precision and efficiency. The numbers are staggering, the logistics astounding, and the impact profound. In essence, the seaports are the arteries of our global economy, pulsating with trade flows round the clock. The world is a global village, and the seaports are its bustling marketplaces. Imagine the world as a vast ocean, and the various countries as islands, each with its own unique resources and needs. Now, imagine the seaports as bustling marketplaces where these islands can exchange their goods. This is essentially what's happening on a grand scale when we talk about global trade, and seaports play a crucial role in this process. Let's take a journey around the world and look at some of these bustling marketplaces. Starting off in the east, we find the port of Shanghai, the busiest port in the world. 
It's like the Grand Bazaar of the Sea handling an astonishing 44 million 20-foot equivalent units of cargo annually. That's a lot of containers. Swinging over to Europe, we find the port of Rotterdam, the largest in Europe. This port is a hub for goods like rubber and leather, vital for Europe's manufacturing industries. Now let's cross the Atlantic to the United States. The port of Los Angeles is the busiest in the Americas, handling a variety of goods from laptops to sports equipment. It's like a giant shopping mall where countries come to pick up their orders. But it's not just about size or volume. The port of Singapore, for instance, is renowned for its efficiency. Despite being smaller in terms of physical size, it manages to handle a massive amount of cargo thanks to its advanced technology and streamlined processes. And let's not forget about the emerging markets. Ports in countries like India and Brazil are rapidly growing, reflecting the economic development of these nations. They're like the up-and-coming stalls in our global marketplace, attracting more and more customers each year. From the busiest ports in China to the thriving docks in the USA, seaports truly are the beating heart of global commerce. They facilitate the exchange of goods between countries and in doing so, they keep the global economy ticking. So next time you use an electronic gadget or wear a leather jacket, remember the vital role that these seaports play in bringing these products to your doorstep. Seaports aren't just about moving goods around, they have a profound impact on our lives and economies. They're like giant cogs in the global economic machine, each turn facilitating the flow of goods and services that drive our world. Let's start with the economic impact. Seaports are vital economic engines, contributing significantly to a nation's gross domestic product or GDP. They generate employment both directly and indirectly, directly by providing jobs for dock workers, customs officials and shipping agents. Indirectly, by fostering industries and businesses that rely on the port for their operations, like logistics, warehousing and manufacturing. Consider this. In the United States alone, more than 23 million jobs are related to port activities. That's about one in every eight jobs. And these aren't just numbers. These are livelihoods, families being supported, communities thriving. But the influence of seaports extends beyond the economic sphere. They also have a social impact. Ports often serve as the heart of coastal communities, shaping their culture and way of life. They bring diversity as goods, people and ideas from around the world converge at these hubs. They foster innovation and progress as businesses adapt to meet the demands of global trade. However, like all human activities, seaports also have an environmental impact. They can contribute to air and water pollution, habitat destruction and climate change. But the good news is, many ports are now taking steps to mitigate these impacts. They're investing in cleaner technologies, implementing stricter environmental regulations, and working towards sustainable operations. Seaports, therefore, aren't just transit points for goods, but catalysts for economic growth and development. They're more than just physical infrastructures. They're vibrant, dynamic spaces where the local meets the global, where tradition meets innovation. Indeed, they're an integral part of our world, shaping and being shaped by the ebb and flow of global trade. As the world continues to evolve, so do our seaports. The future of these bustling hubs of global trade is a fascinating journey that encompasses technological advancements, increased global trade and environmental considerations. In an era where technology is at the forefront of every industry, seaports are no exception. We're beginning to see the integration of artificial intelligence and automation in the daily operations of ports. Imagine autonomous cranes and self-driving trucks moving goods with precision and efficiency, reducing human error and increasing productivity. But it's not just about the movement of goods. The data generated from these operations is another area of growth. Advanced analytics and blockchain technology are set to revolutionize how we track and trace goods, ensuring transparency and accountability in the supply chain. As global trade continues to grow, so does the demand for efficient and expansive seaports. The future will see ports expanding their facilities and capabilities to accommodate the influx of goods. From solar panels and electric goods to nutrition products, laptops, leather, rubber and sports goods, the diversity of imports and exports is set to expand. However, 
This growth is not without its challenges. As the volume of goods increases, so does the environmental impact. Seaports of the future will need to strike a balance between facilitating trade and protecting the environment. This could mean incorporating renewable energy sources, implementing waste management systems and investing in eco-friendly infrastructure. It's clear that the future of seaports is a dynamic one, filled with opportunities and challenges. As these gateways of global trade continue to evolve, they will play a pivotal role in shaping the future of our global economy. As gateways to the future, our seaports continue to navigate the waves of change, charting the course of global trade. So stay tuned as we delve deeper into the world of seaports in our upcoming videos. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more insightful content.